We got a big old video segment here and partly responsible by Tech, who uh, contributed a bunch of videos that <laughs> oddly worked. That oddly worked. So let's go ahead and bring it in here. Oh, God, all the sizing. Uh-oh, something went wrong here. Give me a second. No, that's a curtain. Actually, I don't even have that up, up anymore. Wait, wait, okay. <laughs> Okay. Sorry. Sorry. I don't. Uh, there. Can, can you please do this? There we go. So it's time for Ask Twilight Sparkle. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and put our two viewers back on there because it's been forever since I've had them up there. No, no, no. You're totally off. I think it's going to well, be. Well, I wish. did it's also totally give you the whole. Um, girls? What are you doing? <gasps> Did it start already? Oh, man, I can hardly uh, breathe. Welcome back to Ask Ponies, everybody. Yeah. Uh, today, we're joined by none other than Princess Twilight herself. Wait, what was that? Oh, what? This? <laughs> it's nothing. Pinky. Rainbow. Ugh, fine. We're taking bets. Bets? Bets on what? long before you break. There's no point in hoping you won't anymore, so we figured we'd at least make it more interesting this time. I said two minutes. Then I said one. Girls, we have faced countless monsters, scores of villains, and the end of the world. Now that I'm ruling Equestria, it's my job to keep a level head and calm demeanor for any challenge. Can it's the I end of my bet to 30 seconds? For Twilight, how many books you have in your laboratory in your castel? Hmm. Castel? You, oh, what? poor Twilight. Well, you don't know what you're in for. It's just that I think this pony was trying to ask me how many books are in my library in my castle. Uh, uh, uh. That's not how we do things around here. You have to answer the question as it's read. Uh, well, I think I have a dozen or so in my laboratory. You have a lab? Since when? <laughs> Silly Dashy. How else do you think Twilight brews the potions that will someday keep us all immortal so she doesn't have to live without her friends and family? Right now, it's probably still in the early stages, so it would just turn us into zombies. I told you that in confidence, Pinky. Wasn't a Pinky promise. Wait, what? Twilight, <laughs> why can't I think of a good question to ask you? Good question. Maybe because... Because you suffer from main character syndrome and your personality can be boiled down to a few key catchphrases and emotions. And it would not be hard to figure out how you Rainbow would answer going pretty much anything. on us. Ow. <laughs> Just kidding, Dwy. Uh, next question. To Tilliite. For hookah gods! Is she speaking a foreign dialect? I've never heard of such a language. Nah, she's just having a stroke. <laughs> Hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm going to caption this a little bit. Let's see what happens. Is she speaking a foreign dialect? I've never heard of such a language. Nah, she's just having a stroke. There's no caption. There's no caption, but Twilight. it was worth a shot. How were you in Unicorn to an a la corn? Oh, oui, oui, monsieur, oh, madame, melody. We are the best a la corn in the world. What? Pinky? Sacre bleu, the entree. She is not cooked. What? Dear Twilight, why are you so stuck up? It's spelled D-E-A-R, and there should be a question mark at the end. That's what you're worried about right She's now? She's a grammar Nazi. You know, Pinky, with as much magic as you have, we could have probably beaten all those villains sooner. <laughs> Where's the fun in that? 
Twilight. You big troll. How much fan fiction have you written this past year? I think they meant fan fiction. Oh, wait, wait. Let me tell it. Tell what? About her secret stash of Rabbit Jack fan fiction. Pinky! Go to the pinky corner. She tried to hide it in one of the castle wall secret passages, but I found it. <laughs> I'll always find it. To Twilight, what is your favorite spell? And are you happy that you're a princess? Yeah, 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 we know. It's the wrong you're in grammar, blah, blah, blah. Just answer the question. <sighs> Fine. Yes, I am happy to be a princess. And my favorite spell is one that Trixie taught me, actually. <laughs> Can I get that in potion form? <laughs> to Twilight, sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. What would happen if Pinocchio said, my nose grows now? <laughs> it's like one of those wrestling commercials. Don't ask! It's Sunday, <laughs> Sunday, Sunday! See the Princess of Friendship took it out with the element of loyalty herself. You think you can stand a chance against me, Sparkle? Twilight, are you ever going to get the Flash Sentry, I mean, bread? I'm more disturbed that one of them's dead. Is she gay? What? Is who gay? Yes. <laughs> to the uh, element uh, of friendship, are your books your life or kids? <laughs> I know you mean well, but let's maybe clean up that question a little bit. You see? Just a few edits and you're good to go. It's you have kids? You ate some of the Flash Sentry bread, didn't you? <laughs> to <laughs> what would happen if... One second. Do you mind? Uh, sure. Oh, thank God. To Twilight, what would happen if a relic was broken? For example, the interdimensional mirror. I don't know, Twilight. You could be really offending some of these commenters with your corrections. I... I didn't think about that. The commenters really don't like it when some pony corrects them. Well, I... I was just trying to... I don't think you'll be Do a favorite even win princess for word long crimes? if you keep this I up. I think this is word crimes. No, I... Okay, you win. I won't correct any pony else. I'm so sorry. Let's see how long that lasts. <laughs> and let it begin. To Twinkle Sprinkle, why was your battle with Lord Trainwreck so disappointing? <laughs> Look at that. Proper grammar. Aren't you happy, Twilight? Twinkle Sprinkle? Lord Trainwreck? It's Twilight Sparkle and Lord Tearwreck. The grammar I can forgive, but who in Equestria doesn't know that I'm Twilight Sparkle? That's the joke, Twilight. Ra Rainbow, Rainbow, do you really expect Twilight to understand jokes? Huh, good point. Oh! To Twily Sparky, do you still meet up with Celestia and Luna sometimes after they move to Silver Shore? If Udu, details please. Udu. Twily Sparky? Uh, Twilight, when was the last time you actually answered a question? That stopped being the point a long time ago. Popcorn? Tinkle Drinkle. <laughs> smiley face. Well. Aw, I like the smiley face. They're again. not even trying. <laughs> she drinks all stuff. All of this is her greatest the fear. The problem is, is that I feel like that's going to get you some We're very bad uh, results. <laughs> For it to be like, act Indeed. stupid in front of the other princesses. That's not a question. That's not my name. Oh, shit, she's gonna blow. No, no, she still got some sanity left. Hey, Twig Halite, have you seen the movie Twilight? They spelled my name wrong, but spelled the movie <laughs> title right? <laughs> Get your fireproof gear, Rainbow. Already got you covered. 
to Tewilict Sparkle. Who Twail is your oh, no. so what oh, 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 is it go. Twiggle Go. Twiggle Spiggle. Twiggle. Y'all wonder why I tried to spell stuff right. Twiggle. Twiggle. Question to Twilight Flappy. Twilight Flappy? Twilight Spaghetti. What? Twilight Spaghetti. Two Princess Twilight Sprackle. Two Twilight. Two Twilight greater than. Do you think of Toilet Sparkle that- That sets her off. <laughs> it was the toilet that finally did it, huh? She- she exploded! Rainbow, what have we done? Oh, never mind. Spike says she's alive. She's just rampaging through the castle like a bull in a china shop. How'd he get that scroll to you so quickly? Oh, Twilight must have broken the space-time continuum with that last blast. Spike says she's been raging for hours. Yeah, sounds like Twilight. <laughs> this was so much fun. Godlike power ponies against the all-powerful comment section. <gasps> you know what? We should have another one for Ask Ponies. Hell yeah! That's it for this episode of Ask Ponies. Tune in next time for our special guest, Princess Luna! Leave a question for the princess in the comment section below, but be sure to read the rules first. Bye! Oh, I assume one of the rules on this one was to. You and Celestia was are to dumb. Do stupid I'm not things like dumb. that. It might, it might not be, but probably just not to ask lewd questions. Probably just not to ask lewd questions or kind of messed up stuff. I'll label it Twilight Blackmail material. Also not appropriate things like show us the moon. Yeah. I'm sure Moonbutt isn't going to be showing too much. Maybe it will. Maybe I'm wrong. Well. Anyway, know your castle. Know your meme. Know your stars, know your stars, know your stars. Ah, know your pony and Ori. Oh, mobile game. Oh, no, no I, I'm getting Sims. Sims. I'm, I'm getting Sims vibes, yeah. The money costs reminded me of mobile games. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> That, yeah, I know that rage. <laughs> I know that rage. What so the? Despite all your whoa, rage, whoa, 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 It's the outside, Twilight. <laughs> oh, <damn. laughs> she said spike to the moon. She I just said a lot of things to the moon. Why are you looking at us? Move on. She's raining her boot. We pay a tree. The baker cuts me off. Well, I know another princess I could mooch off of. Or it's just free food. So it's basically a Pegasus only exit. Yep. <laughs> 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 oh god oh. Celestia V2 <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Oh the, the Royal Guard breeding location Why do they um, all look like Anthony C Clone Wars vibes intensifies Oh, like Why are all of them Earth ponies? That's what I'm wondering. Yes? It's cost effective. 
You know, this is making me think the robot chicken thing. Hail Cobra. Hail Cobra. Hail Cobra. Nail Nobra. Nail Nobra. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> What's behind the elevator? Oh my god, it was an elevator. An elevator to an elevator? Oh dear. Yeah. It's an elevator to the TARDIS. Nope, we went full Indiana Jones. Nah, I'm just maybe just a storage area. No, it was just a storage room. Indiana Jones, this would be an endless room full of things. Pandora's box. <laughs> oh, it's a port key. An element necklace? That looks like this the wing necklace from the other episode. Hmm. Does this, this look familiar? Yeah. Now we're talking Indiana Jones. I still laugh at yesterday when I when you were doing the Stanley Pebble and I called it oh the aperture being get it. She probably didn't even need to uh she probably didn't even need to like teleport in there. Probably for the fun of it. Silent alarm. It's another dimension. Wait. Oh, hey. Call the barrier the signal to dimension. Nope, it's a signal player. They found found whatever they were looking for. We found the prime dimension. Oh, right. I forgot about the Council of Glimmers. For the greater good. For the greater good. I don't like the looks of that. And my mother is listening to Video Killed the Radio Star at the moment. And there's a big hole in the throne room. The hell? Plot. The plot thickens. The Not only does it close with that ring and that does something together? With something else, apparently. Hold on.
Ooh, ambiguous. So, it's all to restore the prime group glimmer. Anyway, you assume animation so, teaser. Gonna... You will be okay. What happened to the prime glimmer? I think I missed something. We don't. We're not entirely sure. There's a glimmer with weird it's eyes. Speculation. And no wings. Weird eyes and no wings. Uh, some of them don't have wings either, so it's, it's weird still eyes. it still is something to consider. And I'm sorry, the only you'll be okay. The grand powerful rule of everything. You know you're making me cry, this is the way that I am I've been living a lie, a metamorphical scheme Attempted undercover brotherhood, objective of sin Oh no, no, oh yeah Oh, this what? again Alright, so the rest of this is ponies out of context In different Thank ways you, Jack. But we don't have, unfortunately we don't have time for any of it So we'll have to save it for next week However, I did get a quick something that we're going to plop in here, right here, right now. And then we're going so to we're wrap up. we're within context. Got it. Yeah. Take it for context. Captain on the bridge. Well, not yet, but soon. Ah, the pirate killed me. Oh, the trailer for this. For top is a uh, yay. Sidestep that special. Ah, the goat be powerful, y'all. I can hear it now. Please know your goat. And that's that. Me dare if you take what's mine. One boat. I win one boat. Balance changes. Lobby the grove. Ooh, well, oh, there that's you go. so good. There we go, everybody. Just going to get... That's what we're going to be ending on. Yeah. Actually, you know, Circuit, real quick, since that was there. Um, yeah. Because uh, that, that reminded me of this, uh, something involving the game, which I don't think we... I don't know if it got covered on the on the, on the the show. Uh, a guy that I follow on YouTube, uh, Coefficient, mm -hmm. He uh, he's a big fighting game streamer and, ev and everything. Oh. He he actually did an entire video just praising how them fighting herds did their tutorial. Ooh, actually, that sounds good. I don't think we've like, ever yeah, it's, really jumped it's into been a long that, time yeah. since I played the game, so it's probably I haven't probably visited their tutorial. Like, like yeah, he just started. Like he started up the game. He decided to do the tutorial a little bit, and he and he just kept going with it. Like he, it was it's one of those things where. He immediately recognized how, like, how the game played, but he was actually just really praising, like, how they went through the actual tutorial for new people. Like, they actually, like, actually kind of, like, how it actually introduces people to, like, you know, a lot of terminology and stuff. Nice. That goes, uh, that goes well and beyond for your fan base who probably aren't used to fighting games. 
Well, that, that is the whole point of a tutorial to give people that aren't used to I fighting know, but games. Some but... tutorials don't go into too much into depth to expect you to know some of the stuff. Or ahead. either that, or they just give you basics without really teaching you much. But that, that's nice. I'm glad to hear the tutorial so well. We might have to actually take a look at that in the near future then. Yeah. All I know is that apparently I'm fighting her net code is so good that, yeah, it's better than most of the other fighting games that are around. Didn't we come across that for one of the fighting cons? Uh, Evo. They, that, yeah, 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 they focused on fighting herds. Yeah, they were going to bring it in at the Evo. Unfortunately, he had problems. Yeah. But we're going to leave that alone. Instead, the song means that it's time to wrap things up for the evening. I hope you guys had fun. We captioned quite a few pictures, so we literally only got to maybe a fourth of everything we found, so that was hilarious. And nevertheless, uh, we it was a great time for all, and I can't wait for the next time. But for now, let's give everybody their final shout-out for the evening, starting off with Crazy McCaptain. The uh, fires, explosions, and toss of fennus and turkey yellowy round, I don't know. Then DM21. Have a great week and stay healthy. And Tex Stallion. I know. And Toakoi. Thanks everyone for showing up. Thank you for Commander and CMC for being on mods. Thank you to uh, Abo Castillo, uh, our tray friend, Cam. And Bible Thumbs, uh, Commander Root, Sarcasm, DM12, over Drop A, or Drop Dog, sorry, uh, Electronic Longboard, Loomies, uh, Funny Man 64, The Young Tech Man, me, our relay chat, uh, your uh, utensil, Zine, uh, Zenix, uh, sorry, uh, Violet CD as well. How many people do we have in that Twitch chat now? Uh, it says nine, but... You know what? I love you all, regardless. Let's go on, Suki of the Otaku Ascended. Uh, you know, get, go get some sleep, better, buddy. All right. That, I'd like to thank you all for joining us for another episode of The Bernie Show. Reminder that er, an hour early is a coffee house after party with Command or something. If you want to have some fun with... Oh, wait, uh, Command or something? What? Not Command or something. Why did I say that? The the equestrian flag stuff with coal dust. I don't know why I said commander. Sorry, commander. But he yeah, you still run the pre show, so no, that know. it's it's been up. It hasn't done that in weeks. I don't know what that was. Years. It's been years. See, I'm tired. Let me di let me just try to run through this thing then as quickly as I can without stumbling. Coal dust pre show hour early. Be sure to tune in. If you're watching us live, you can watch. You can join us for the Coffeehouse After Party. That will be on Vaughn. So be sure to check that out on theburnyshow.net. Also, throughout the week, keep an eye on our Discord. Random streams will pop up. I'm currently doing a collaboration with Cybertronics, going through all of their recent games, as well as a couple of new ones as they come out. Along with that, Sunday, Circuit's Gaming Room. We got games. We're going to be playing them. Along with that, after the gaming room, sometimes Mogul Dash will come on, do her thing. Lots of fun stuff. And that is about it. Big thing, keep uh, an eye true. on... Yeah. Added note, uh, from whatever I'm calling of the background chatter, uh, Winchester Wednesdays might be returning within the next two weeks. Ooh, exciting. Yay. Can't wait for that. Missed that. All right. So keep an eye out. Winchester Wednesdays may be returning in a couple weeks. But along with that, I do want to give a shout out to our IRC chatters. Thank you to Commando Something and Crazy Mac Captain for keeping an eye on chat. Thank you to Claudia Taconiquist, Cool Dude, Sarcasm, Fantastic Raid, Relay Surf, Techman, Textilian, and yay, Archivers. And of course, a big shout out to all of our archive watchers on YouTube and on Twitch. Uh, um, big shout out to our stream watchers on YouTube, Twitch, and Vaughn. However you catch us, however you enjoy us, thank you so much for spending some time out to check us out, have some fun with us, do some silliness, and joining us for another week of Brony Community Shenanigans. And with that in mind, we have our final video of the evening. 
song, A Changeling Can Change, Snow Swirl Remix. And with that, have a good night, everybody. Changely